Hey everyone, welcome back to Brain Boosters. Today we're going to be talking about a very interesting topic, Sigma males. Sigma males are often misunderstood, and many people confuse them with alpha males or beta males. In this video, we're going to be discussing 12 obvious signs that you're a Sigma male. But first, let's talk a bit about what a Sigma male is. A Sigma male is someone who doesn't conform to traditional social norms and expectations. They are independent, self-sufficient, and tend to be introverted. Unlike alpha males, sigma males don't seek attention or validation from others, and they often prefer to work alone. Alpha and beta male classifications are common, but sigma males might still be unfamiliar. The sigma male traits fall into a bracket that exists beyond the conventional masculine classification. Therefore, before you enter into a relationship, it is vital to know whether you are dating a Sigma male or not. Knowledge about someone's personality helps us understand them and their motivations. For instance, you might be dating a Sigma male and wrongly treating them like a beta male. Here we will help you understand what a Sigma male means and the clear-cut signs that you might be dating one. What is the difference between a Sigma male and an Alpha male? A sigma male and an alpha male are much different from each other even though they have some similarities. Their similarities often lead to confusion that demolishes prospects. First off, sigma males do not appreciate being in the limelight, they prefer to operate from the shadows without craving public recognition. In comparison, one of the critical signs of alpha males is that they want everyone to hear them and listen to them. Therefore, they see no reason to remain in the limelight because they desire to be known. Another distinguishing factor between a sigma male and versus alpha male is dominance. Sigma males know that they don't need dominance to achieve great results. They see other people as collaborators and not as competitors. On the other hand, alpha males like to dominate and compete anywhere they are. Personality development coach Sean Wayne, in his book Alpha Male Bible, talks about the alpha male as being the master of every situation and group. Sigma males are instead masters of themselves and feel no need to command everything and everyone around them. So, if you're curious to know if you're a sigma male, keep watching this video. Now, let's get into the 12 obvious signs you're a sigma male. Sign number 1. You value your independence above all else. One of the most obvious signs that you're a sigma male is that you value your independence above all else. Sigma males are known for their self-sufficiency and ability to thrive without relying on others. If you find that you prefer to work alone and that you don't like being micromanaged, then you might be a sigma male. Sigma males are also very selective about the people they allow into their lives. They don't feel the need to be surrounded by a large social circle, and they tend to keep their inner circle small. If you find that you value your alone time and don't feel the need to constantly be around other people, then you might be a sigma male. Sign number two. You're an independent thinker. Another sign that you're a sigma male is that you're an independent thinker. Sigma males tend to think outside the box, and they don't conform to traditional ways of thinking. They often have their own unique perspective on the world, and they're not afraid to voice their opinions. Sigma males are also very analytical, and they tend to question everything. They don't just accept things at face value, they want to understand the underlying reasons behind them. If you find that you're someone who questions things, and that you have your own unique perspective on the world, then you might be a sigma male. Sign number three. You're comfortable with yourself. Another sign that you're a sigma male is that you're comfortable with yourself. Sigma males are confident in who they are, and they don't feel the need to change themselves to fit in with others. They're comfortable with their strengths and weaknesses, and they don't feel the need to prove anything to anyone. Sigma males are also very adaptable, and they're able to thrive in different situations. They don't get flustered easily, and they're able to handle stress well. If you find that you're comfortable with yourself and that you're able to adapt to different situations easily, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number 4. You value authenticity. Sigma males tend to value authenticity over conformity. They don't try to fit in with others or pretend to be someone they're not. Instead, they're comfortable with who they are, and they're not afraid to show their true selves to the world. They tend to be very honest and direct in their communication, 
and they don't shy away from speaking their minds. Sigma males also tend to have a strong sense of integrity. They have a set of values that they live by, and they don't compromise on those values for anyone. If you find that you value authenticity and that you have a strong sense of integrity, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number five. You're creative and innovative. Sigma males tend to be very creative and innovative. They're not afraid to take risks and try new things, and they often come up with unique solutions to problems. They tend to be very resourceful, and they're able to think outside the box to find solutions to difficult challenges. Sigma males also tend to be very curious, and they have a thirst for knowledge. They're always looking for ways to learn and grow, and they're not afraid to try new things. If you find that you're creative, innovative, and curious, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number six. You're a natural leader. Sigma males are often natural leaders, although they tend to lead in a different way than alpha males. While alpha males tend to lead through dominance and assertiveness, sigma males tend to lead through their actions and their ability to inspire others. Sigma males tend to be very confident in their abilities, and they're not afraid to take charge when necessary. They're also very good at motivating others and helping them achieve their goals. If you find that you're a natural leader who inspires others and has a strong sense of confidence, then you might be a sigma male. Sign number seven. You're observant and analytical. Sigma males tend to be very observant and analytical. They pay close attention to their surroundings and are always looking for patterns and connections. They're able to analyze complex information and make sense of it in a way that others may not be able to. Sigma males also tend to be very detail oriented. They notice things that others might overlook, and they're able to pick up on subtle cues and signals. They use this information to make informed decisions and navigate the world around them. If you find that you're observant and analytical, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number eight. You're resilient and adaptable. Sigma males tend to be very resilient and adaptable. They're able to handle setbacks and challenges with ease, and they don't let adversity get in their way. They're able to bounce back quickly from failure and use it as a learning experience to grow and improve. Sigma males also tend to be very adaptable. They're able to adjust to new situations and environments with ease, and they're able to thrive in a variety of different circumstances. They're not afraid of change and are able to embrace it as an opportunity for growth. If you find that you're resilient and adaptable, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number nine. You're emotionally intelligent. Sigma males tend to be very emotionally intelligent. They're able to understand and manage their own emotions, as well as the emotions of others. They have a high level of empathy and are able to connect with others on a deep level. They're able to read people well and understand their motivations and desires. Sigma males also tend to be very good at conflict resolution. They're able to diffuse tense situations and find common ground with others. They're able to communicate effectively and express themselves in a way that is clear and non threatening. If you find that you're emotionally intelligent and good at conflict resolution, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number 10. You're introspective and self-aware. Sigma males tend to be very introspective and self-aware. They're able to reflect on their own thoughts and feelings and understand themselves on a deep level. They're able to identify their own strengths and weaknesses and use this knowledge to improve themselves. Sigma males also tend to be very honest with themselves. They don't shy away from their own flaws and shortcomings, and they're willing to work on them to become a better person. They have a growth mindset and are always looking for ways to improve themselves. If you find that you're introspective and self-aware, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number 11. You're comfortable with silence. Sigma males tend to be comfortable with silence. They don't feel the need to constantly talk or fill the air with noise. They're able to be in the presence of others without feeling the need to constantly engage in conversation. They're comfortable with silence and often use it as a way to reflect on their thoughts and feelings. Sigma males also tend to be good listeners. They're able to listen to others without feeling the need to interject or dominate the conversation. They're able to empathize with others and provide support without needing to offer a lot of words. 
If you find that you're comfortable with silence and are a good listener, then you might be a Sigma male. Sign number 12. Your low maintenance. Sigma males tend to be very low maintenance. They don't require a lot of attention or validation from others. They're comfortable being alone and don't feel the need to constantly be surrounded by people. They're also not high maintenance when it comes to material possessions. They don't require a lot of material things to be happy and content. Sigma males also tend to be very self-sufficient. They're able to take care of themselves and don't need others to do things for them. They're able to handle their own problems and challenges without relying on others for help. If you find that you're low maintenance and self-sufficient, then you might be a Sigma male. Benefits of being a Sigma male Walking your very own path, not following the crowds, and being a bit of a lone wolf definitely have many benefits. For me personally, there are two really big benefits that are clear. Number 1. Freedom. Freedom is definitely the biggest benefit that comes from being a Sigma. When you don't even care to pay attention to what other people think about you or the way you live your life, you will definitely feel a lot more freedom. Both mentally, emotionally, and probably physically too. The Sigma lives life on his own terms and never bends to what others might have to say. This is the ultimate freedom, going about life on your terms 100%. Number 2. Efficient. As a Sigma, you don't live a life based on what is expected of you. You don't keep up with the crowd. Nor do you follow the crowd in any way, shape, or form. And with this comes a high level of efficiency. You get things done. And you get things done quickly. This is due to the fact that you are used to being your own captain and trying to achieve anything you set your sights on. Drawbacks of being a Sigma male. Although there are a few benefits that come with being a Sigma, there are also a few drawbacks. You could probably imagine what some of these drawbacks might be, but for this video, I want to focus on the main drawback of being a Sigma male, you have no tribe, so it can get lonely. 1. Sigmas, by definition, do not need a tribe. 2. They don't have to be the leader of the pack. 3. They are their own pack. And this is great but it can also get lonely. It's kind of funny that the best thing and the worst thing about being a Sigma are the same, you are a lone wolf. But remember, you can transition and create a tribe. Just because you are a lone wolf today doesn't mean it has to be like this for life. Sometimes we need to live the Sigma male lifestyle for a bit, though, in order to focus on what we want to achieve in life. People often ask these questions. Do Sigma males fall in love? The answer is yes. Just like every other male, Sigma males fall in love. If a Sigma male likes you, they won't beat around the bush, they will be direct and not indulge in mind games. Sigma males bring honesty and loyalty to the table and value the same in their partners. In addition, most Sigma males prefer to create a strong bond with their partner instead of having flings. They value serious relationships and like to make sure that they can envision a future together. But once they are convinced, they will directly approach you. Sigma men will engage in meaningful conversation to assess the possibility of a future together. They might even indulge in some subtle flirting if they think it will work for them. Can you go from alpha male to sigma male? I honestly do believe you can. We are never supposed to constantly be the same man. Time happens. Things happen. And people change. I think I can speak from personal experience when I say that you can rather easily, without even knowing it, go from being more of an alpha male to a sigma male. Up until a few years ago, I had many traits that would say I leaned more toward being an alpha. But I then started traveling and backpacking solo for about two years, and things started changing without me even noticing. I started enjoying being alone more, I loved the peace and quiet, and my thoughts about my own life became more clear. Ever since then, I have been on the path to becoming a Sigma male. And I love it. Who are some famous Sigma males? It may surprise you to learn that there are quite a few well-known men who would qualify as Sigma men. Currently, it is difficult to identify every single renowned Sigma male, but we have listed seven of them below. 1. Steve Jobs Steve Jobs requires no introduction. 
he is known as one of the founders of Apple, which has had a huge impact on all of our lives. Jobs would often go against the grain and do things his way. 2. Keanu Reeves For all of you fans out there that love his movies, it's pretty obvious to see that he is Sigma. Especially if you have watched his interviews. He is an extremely intriguing person, and we don't actually know that much about his personal life. Although he is often spotted just chilling out and about alone. If you have seen the John Wick films, then you'll definitely be able to draw a line between what the Sigma male archetype is, and John Wick himself. 3. Muhammad Ali Ali, the most famous boxer to ever live, was also a Sigma male. He often went against the norm. He refused to join the army and spoke out a lot against discrimination. 4. David Bowie David Bowie was one of the most famous musicians of recent times. He was also somewhat mysterious, and in many ways, he did resemble the traits of a Sigma. 5. Clint Eastwood Clint Eastwood, the famous actor and director, is definitely a guy who has always marched to the beat of his own drum. He is over 90 years old, but still working and going strong. 6. Bruce Lee We all know Mr. Lee as the ultimate martial arts legend. And on top of that, his interviews have become popular because of the way he views life. He was also somewhat following, doing exactly what he believed to be right and not what was expected of him. 7. Tom Cruise Tom Cruise, probably the biggest movie star of our generation, is also a Sigma male. Even though he is such a megastar, he does keep a lot to himself. What is a Sigma male attracted to? Sigma males are usually on the lookout for partners who have similar traits. Therefore, it might be a turnoff for the Sigma male if you cannot look out for yourself. They prefer someone who is independent and capable of taking care of themselves with confidence. Sigma males appreciate maturity, therefore, they like someone who allows them space and maturely handles things. They don't like to play games and appreciate someone who is the same way. They prefer their ideal partner to be someone who reveals their feelings and is not hiding them. Are Sigma males smart? Sigma males are smart and intelligent individuals who have a knack for digesting and filtering the correct information. In addition, they have a robust memory where they store valuable information. More so, one of the lovely Sigma male characteristics is their ability to observe and strategize cautiously. So, there you have it, the 12 obvious signs that you're a Sigma male. Remember, being a Sigma male is not a label that you should use to define yourself completely. It's merely a set of characteristics that can help you understand yourself better. If you find that you possess some of these traits, it's okay, there's nothing wrong with it. However, it's important to note that not everyone will fit into this category. There's no one-size-fits-all when it comes to human behavior, and we all have unique personalities and characteristics that make us who we are. If you're interested in learning more about Sigma men, there are plenty of online resources available, such as books, forums, and social media groups. In conclusion, being a Sigma male means valuing independence, being comfortable with yourself, and not conforming to societal expectations. It's about being true to yourself and living life on your terms. So, whether you're a Sigma male or not, remember to embrace your individuality and stay true to who you are. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video.